Good morning and welcome to my channel. Today is Friday, Cafe con Maria, where I have my cup of coffee and I let you know what the universe, the angels, the cosmos has in store for us. Today's a beautiful day. I know it's the end of the week. It's time for us to either go out to dinner, go see a movie. It's time to enjoy the weekend. I'm going to start off with you Capricorn today. Capricorn, um, it is time for you to really focus on yourself. What are the things that you want for the new year? Um, what is it that it's going to make you happy? You need to, you have a lot of beautiful dreams that they can come into flourishing, but you have to take the step to in order to achieve them. Um, you need to not bring the same havoc, the same problems that you've had this year into the new year. If you have and are surrounding yourself with negative people, it's time to, you know, little by little, you know, cut them off because all that negative energy is not allowing you to fulfill the dream that you want to achieve. You know, we don't do what I do. Every three months, I go in my closet, you know, any shoes, any clothes that I don't like, I don't, I know that I'm not going to wear anymore, I give it away. So if you're in a relationship and that relationship isn't giving you the happiness, the stability that you're looking for, then, you know, give it away. How you give it away? You just let it go. You know, you can't um, continue the path that you're in because the majority of the time you're very upset and you're very upset with yourself because you know this is not good for you but you still are there you know just take a good look and change whatever you need to change okay capricorn the next one is aquarius aquarius um you need to go seek medical um treatment you know you need to go see a doctor for those headaches the back pain back pains i'm sorry your hands are hurting your feet are hurting you're swollen you know i know that you are in a state of depression right now you know you need to try to come out of that i know that loneliness is um is consuming you you know give a friend a call give a family member a call you know do something you know go out you know whether it's to the mall or you know even if it's grocery shopping, just get out of the house. And if you continue, you know, with that loneliness and because you feel no one wants to be around you or loves you, then buy yourself a dog. I have a dog and I love my dog. My dog keeps me happy. All right. The next one is Pisces. Pisces, you need to learn not to take life so serious. There's a time to be serious and there's a time to have fun. You know, you get upset sometimes with your friends because... Some, you have some friends that they like to joke. They're always laughing. Learn from them. You know, don't take life so serious. You know, have fun. You know, it's okay to laugh. It's okay to be silly. You know, you know, have fun. You know, um, don't if if someone tells you and you know if, if you know that table is is um is red and the person tells you no it is red you know don't contradict yourself and say no it's black you know don't try to to be too serious don't you know don't take life too serious don't try to undermine someone because you know the one who's going to end up at the end feeling sorry for themselves it's going to be you all right pisces the next one is Aries. Aries, you need to stop complaining. If you're not happy in the situation you are, and if you feel that life is passing you by, and you want to, you know, to have, you wanted to do this, you wanted to have done this, and you haven't done it, stop procrastinating, Aries. You have the tools, you have the mentality to achieve your dreams, you know, to get to where you want to go. You know, don't be afraid, you know, take the little leap, you know, Take the jump, you know, have faith, you know, um, follow your dreams, but don't just keep staying stuck because that's what is convenient for you. You know, you need to do things differently. All right, Aries. The next one is Taurus. Taurus, a lot of great things are coming your way. A lot of great things are coming your way. Whether it's um, a new home, 
good things, everything, great things. A new companion, you know, a lady luck is going to be knocking on your door, you know. But also, I would like to uh, emphasize that appreciate. Learn to appreciate um, the things that are coming your way. And don't try to be greedy. If you see someone that you know you can truly help, and you see someone that is sincere with you, you know, give them a helping hand. Even if it's having a conversation, going out for coffee or something. But a lot of great things are coming your way, which you deserve. Because you've been praying about it. You've been asking the universe. And they finally heard you. And a lot of good things are coming your way. Learn to embrace it. And learn to share a little bit. It's sharing is caring. Remember that. The next one is Gemini. Gemini, you've been through a lot of learning, you know, with a lot of bad lessons that happen and learning who you are, learning what you're going to stand for and what you're not. But please do not let someone take you for a fool. Um, please do not. Open your eyes and open your ear. You need to listen what is being said around you. You need to look at what is being around you. You know, don't let someone take you or take this or, you know, take advantage of you. You know, learn. You have to learn. It's okay to say no and it's okay to say yes. If you feel that um, you don't want to help someone, then, you know, don't help that person. You know, if that person has disrespected you that person hasn't been there for you then why are you gonna give when they never receive you know just because somebody's coming to you with tears in their eye doesn't mean they're sincere that can be um crocodile tears remember that saying gemini the next one is leo leo you finally got everything that you wanted you finally got everything you want you asked for this and you asked for that and you finally got it all right leo um finally god has listened to you leo you know with everything with your health with your children with everything that was going around you that you were in a depression state that you were in a very sad place you know you built yourself continue building yourself and continue you know being on top of the world all right leo because you are a great human being you know learn to you have to appreciate yourself so people can appreciate you all right leo the next one is virgo virgo you should take a little trip you know take a little trip where there is um I don't know. Sit by a rock in the beach. Or go by a lake. You need to take. You need to take trip. You need to let people come into your life because life is not just home, work, children, husband, or wife. That's not life. You have to learn to enjoy life. There's people that want to connect with you, but um, you're too serious, and the way they look at you, they think that you know uh, they're gonna step on boundaries and they're not let people know that you are this very funny um life of the party you know person that you do love to enjoy life you know um don't act to what's the word i'm looking without offending anyone um let that inner child that fun child come up you know let that inner child you need that you need to to laugh more you need to take a little bit of an adventure you know something things that are going to make you you know happy you know whether it is hanging out with uh, a cousin or a family or a sister or a brother that you haven't seen in a long time even if it's engaging in a conversation where you are going to laugh you need to put more laughter in your life so um you won't be always you know mean looking sorry Okay, the next one is Libra. Libra, what can I say to you? Everything you have asked for is right there. You are going to see the good 
and the bad that you ask for. That's why it's very, um, we have to be very careful when we upset what we ask for because the universe seems to give us exactly what we ask for. So Libra, just take a deep breath, you know, enjoy all the good things that are coming. You know, you got a little bit of presence coming your way. You got some good things coming your way. You have divine justice on your way that they are going to show you, you know, who did you wrong, who appreciated you, who's the one that put you in a conflict that you shouldn't have. So, you know, everything you have asked for, you are going to see it with your own eyes. Okay, Libra? The next one is um, Scorpio. Scorpio, be careful with your mouth. Be careful with your mouth. Be careful who you offend. Be careful who you try to have an argument with. You know, you need to measure your words before they are spoken. If you are upset with a family member, a friend, or even your spouse, do not let the anger say words that you cannot take back. Do not. Because you will be saying things that you, are our contents that you shouldn't have said. And that's what's going to create is a, an explosion of a volcano. So, you know, be very careful how you express yourself. Be very careful how you make a person feel. Be very careful how you try to degrade a person. You know, you need to be careful with your mouth. All right, Scorpio. The next one is Sagittarius. Sagittarius. Um, you need to be very careful, whether it's in a party or a family gathering, or even if you go to a bar, be careful with your drinking because sometimes you overdo it. You don't leave your drink there. Just be very, very careful. Um, you never know who's out to do you harm. So, you know, be very wise. Be very wise. You shouldn't be, you know, you shouldn't drink and drive. You shouldn't um, try to have a conversation that you need to get something off your chest with a person when you have drank. No, that is called disaster. So you need to be very careful. Very, very, very careful, Sagittarius. Um, I know that at times, you know, you just... You know, kind of forget things, you know, and you just go with the flow. But you need to be careful with that flow because sometimes that flow is not going to make you grow. So, again, thank you everyone for tuning into my channel, um, Cafe con Maria. I will be making different videos because this channel also I want to implement, I want to empower people, I want to show them how they can connect spiritually. So, I will be making um, a few videos how to you know prepare your candles how to clean your candles um which is your guardian angel according to your horoscope what is the candle that you should use when you are um praying or talking to that angel and what time of the day or in the evening you can connect more so again i will be putting up um more videos if there's anything that you want to learn or you have a question for me please feel free um to to leave your comments you know and i you know and i do i do do private readings i am you know i do private readings you know i do um different tarot cards i i have a very extensive knowledge in the spiritual world you know i'm gifted by birth you know so again if there's anything you want to learn, any questions you might have, please feel free to um, to let me know in the comments. And please, if you really love my channel, you can see me on YouTube. It's Cafe Con Maria, put the number seven you know, next to it. And please tell your friends. And again, have a blessed day. Remember, don't lose faith. Because with faith, you can accomplish everything you want to have. Again, ciao. See you tomorrow.